hi everyone in today's video i am going to perform a restore of a backup file that's stored in s3 bucket so in the previous tutorial i have sh shown you how to create the backup file and move those file to the s3 uh, bucket so continuing to that in today's uh, video i would be restoring the tabu server using these two uh, backup files so uh, before uh, restoring the backup so this is the current uh, tableau servers we have three sites here like site 1 and 2 and the default site so uh, let me uh, let me delete the site 1 and 2 right so uh, i am deleting st these two sites and then i would be restoring the uh, data from these two files and we should be expecting those site both the sites to be restored back so this is like a proof that the restore has been actually performed so uh, let me stop the tableau server now so this is the first step that we need to perform uh, we need to run tsm stop command from the ssh or from the tsm web ui so uh, simultaneously i would be sshing into the ec2 instance Okay, let's check the status. It's okay, it's uh, right now turning off the Tableau server. So let's wait for a couple of minutes and then we will be performing all these uh, actions. So the Tableau server has been stopped completely. And now let me check the status again. It should show as stopped. Okay, it's stopped right now. So uh, the first step is to copy these backup files from S3 bucket into our EC2 uh, machine. So uh, this is the standard copy command that I would be running. So AWS S3 CP and this is the location of the backup file in s3 and space this is the second line is the path where the file should be copied so copy paste So the file has been copied <coughs> into this uh, path. We this is the default path where the Tableau backup should be placed, uh, or whenever a backup is created, this is the default path where the backup gets generated. So even when we need to perform a restore from the file, we need to place that TSBAK file into this particular appropriate path itself so placing it at home directory and running the maintenance restore command would not work that's the reason why we have copied that to this exact location that's the default location next i will be running the tsm maintenance restore command tsm maintenance restore hyphen hyphen file space the name of the uh, backup file that's backup hyphen 2023 n2.tsb ak so hit enter so here we can see restoring the backup using server side file name this particular file 
and this is the um, all the status of the uh, restoration steps so the same thing is being reflected into the tsm web ui as well the uh, restore has been completed successfully next we will copy the settings file in the similar way <coughs> into our home directory so it's downloaded then we need to import the settings file by running this command tsm settings import hyphen f and path to the json file enter so now next we need to run tsm pending changes apply It's completed successfully deployed nodes with updated configuration and topology version. So the last thing is to run the uh, start the tableau server. So I am just doing it uh, from the UI itself. It would take around three to four minutes. Uh, it depends on the size of the EC2 distance. the uh, tableau server has been started so uh, as we have deleted the sites right earlier before restoring so let let me log in and check if the sites are back okay so i see the sites site one and site two has been uh, restored so <clears throat> we can say that the uh, tableau server has been successfully restored using the uh, those uh, backup backup file so this is a simple uh, method by which the backup can be created and moved to s3 and again it can be restored using these uh, simple steps so thank you everyone